You're okay, bud. We've seen this deer out in the middle of the lake this morning. It's so deep out here. It's like 90 feet. We're trying to coax him back to land. He's slowly going. Come on, buddy. You're almost there. He's made it. He made it. See you later, fun. <laughs> All right, so we just kind of coaxed that deer back to shore. He was literally right in the middle of the lake and he was just swimming even deeper. So to be honest, I'm not sure if he would have made it if we didn't see him. What do you think, Hall? Uh, pretty far to land out there. Oh, uh, he was looking pretty tired. Glad he's safe. That one? Okay. First fish of the morning. All right, my first bass in the morning. Not a bad little smallie. Uh, got him on this, it's all wrapped up in the net right now, but it's just a KVD sexy dog bone color. Too much credit. Pressure. Ooh! Another guy this morning, Rag Chapo. You're like in the top water. Check out this toad. Look at that bass. That's what we've been looking for all week. Nice big small mouth. All right, let's get this big slob back. See you later, big girl. What'd you think of our trip, hon? It was good. We caught a lot of fish, a couple of decent smallies, one Big smallie, I'd say. A couple largemouth and then the one walleye. You got that one real nice pike too. So I'd say it was good. I mean, when we were driving up here, we were looking at the forecast and it looked pretty bad, like unfishable almost. So it turned out to be pretty good weather and I'm sure it's safe to say we'll be back up here, right? Yep. All right, so that just about wraps it up. We're just gonna pack up, go get the boat on the trailer. It was uh, good to see the boat running good after, this is the first time we've had it out this season, so I'm happy everything's running properly. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys in the next video.